Hi everybody. In this video we're going to take a quick look at the keyboard settings in Windows 7 and the three key things that you can adjust with that. The first is the repeat delay and that is the length of time between when you first press a key and when that key begins to repeat the same character and here's a line of A's to show you what I mean by that. The next thing we'll look at is repeat rate and that's simply just how quickly a key repeats once it begins repeating so how quickly will it fill up a line or a page as you go forward. And then the third thing is the cursor blink rate and that's just how fast the cursor flashes to indicate its location. Now we don't have a cursor on the screen right now so I'm going to close the presentation just so I can show you what a, what a cursor looks like. So here's our cursor and you see right now it's blinking very slowly. That's the third thing that we can control when we uh, go into the Windows 7 keyboard settings. To start in making the adjustment, uh, uh, naturally enough, you go to the Start menu. And to get to the Start menu, if you don't know, in a standard Windows 7 setup, you go to the extreme bottom left-hand corner of your monitor or your window. And you see when we get there, it, uh, it'll kind of uh, give us a little pop-up window that says Start. You click on that, and when you click on that, it brings up this menu, which includes the control panel and that's where, where we're going to need to go right now so we click on control panel and that brings up this window on this window you'll find the word keyboard which and you see all of these anything you hover over will give you a little bit of information about what's in it in this case we want keyboard so we're going to click on keyboard and then here are the three settings we just we just talked about uh, they're in a slightly different order but it's uh, repeat delay repeat rate and cursor blink rate and has a nifty little window here where you can test this as you go through so if you click your cursor in here and you press press down and hold a key I'm gonna use the K key here so when I I want you to watch closely as I press the K how quickly it then begins to repeat and then how quickly it, it fills up so press and repeat okay you can also, by the way, see how quickly the cursor is blinking there as well. So let's let's check that first because that's kind of the easiest to see. If we take the cursor blink rate and move it all the way to fast, actually right there, you can see how fast that's blinking. For some people, that uh, makes it easier to find the cursor when they're looking for it. For me, a, a cursor blinking that fast just kind of drives me crazy. So I leave it somewhere in the middle. Um, so let's uh, test now if we do, if we make the repeat delay long and that's what we do if maybe we're a little bit heavy-handed on the keyboard uh, our fingers stay on the key a long time uh, you want a lot of time between the time you press the key and it begins to repeat so let's try that here I'm gonna press the K again I press K and then it repeats and you see it took a while for it to begin to begin to repeat um, just for comparison we'll do it the same thing as we make it a short repeat so we press and you see how quickly now the key begins to repeat uh, and none of that is, a, is is affecting how the the repeat rate that is how fast those keys go across and you see I have a little bit uh, faster than slow but we can see how the changes if I go fast you'll see it begins to fill up very very quickly and if instead it's slow and you just by the way you click and drag these one way or the other so if we click in here again and you see now it types very slowly across I'm just holding the key down and it goes slowly and without even changing it we can go fast here and you see how fast that is okay so um, once you've got it to the right that you like it and you'll want to experiment a little bit with all of these things you then click OK and that will immediately affect everything you do on the on the computer you'll be up, begin to use the new settings immediately uh, I hope this has made sense for everybody uh, and um, watch for new videos as they become available thanks